hello there. Welcome to uh, a very bold video. Well, actually, not really a bold video. I mean, maybe. I don't know if you're going to like what I'm about to do, which is, you might find it hard to believe, I have never had a Hot Pocket before. I know I don't. I, I was young once, but back in those days, the only thing I knew about Hot Pockets is cheese was definitely in them, and I just was not big on cheese. I'm still not. And yes, everyone makes that that face and but my tastes have grown and I figured you know why not try a hot pocket for the first time and in case anybody is uh, curious about that sort of thing what does somebody think about trying one for the first time especially after they don't have a young person's taste buds anymore also I did try some pizza pocket things at school that just did not did not treat me well at all and hot pockets also being a pocket that looked almost exactly the same, I, I decided to put them off for a few decades. So I am going to, well, go and see what a Hot Pocket is going to be like. Okay, I have returned with the Hot Pocket. Um, it actually took a bit of staring at the case of the Hot Pockets to decide what my first experience was going to be. And, well, to be quite honest, I didn't have high hopes for it. So I went with the Chili, Spicy, Chili, Philly, something. Sponsored by the Hot One. So I heard of the show and I thought maybe, maybe this one will be my best chance to like its touted pockety goodness. Yeah, I did. I did not microwave it. I, I took to the oven with it again. Figure might as well try making the first experience a good one. Or at least a decent one. It, uh, it's not as gross and mushy as I remember the school pizza pockets being or well since this is my first one I don't know what other hot pockets are like either so let's see it it's not that bad it is definitely and I like spicy food um I don't think it's overly spicy it, I believe it's a a five that it was rated I'm pretty sure there there will be people out here that probably try it and they're probably crying or something which is fine I respect it not everybody can do the spicy stuff <clears throat> I don't know why the, well, I can, you definitely taste the, the jalapenos, eh? but there's a really weird, I'm not sure what's going on. I mean, it says real cheese on the box, but there, if the mic picks up chewing, I apologize. I know that's a thing for some people. I have no idea what it is. I guess the, the pocket is pretty okay. There's just, I cannot place, there's just a really strange, it's almost got a weird bitter to it. And I, I don't know, I, I don't know if it's like, Tastes too weird for an ingredient. Yeah, there's like a weird bitter thing to it. It's probably all of the the essences that you get from the processing process. Um, I guess for a snack it's okay. Maybe. I mean, I wouldn't. I'm going to see if I know anyone that will have the the other pocket. I mean, it tastes better than I thought. It doesn't quite. It doesn't quite feel like my body is really going going to be satisfied with this as a snack. And I actually was a little peckish but yeah i don't know what it is it's like i'm eating it but it is not really it's not really registering food wise and also there's not really a lot of filliness coming through but that might be a bit the difference between the jalapeno and bell pepper but i don't know if there's mushrooms in it since that's sometimes a philly thing or always a philly thing i just i don't i don't particularly like mushrooms so i try to avoid those with philly things but yeah, whatever that thing I can't place, that weird bitter, I mean, the the beef, it definitely looks like that weird gray processed beef where it's allegedly, allegedly meat. Yeah, I mean, you can tell they're peppers. I mean, I know those are real. Yeah, there's just a weird processed fakiness that comes through with this that's just really strange. All in all, I don't have a rating system in place yet, so I don't even know how to rate it. Uh, it's just, there have to be better quick, cheap snacks. I might endeavor to look for some and see how uh, how they stack up. Um, I am definitely going to have to go find a snack of a bit more substance. So those of you out there that might passionately snack on the Hot Pockets, I remember the days when uh, I really dug the pizza rolls, which I might have to revisit because, yeah, there was just a, a time that they suddenly weren't so good and I kind of swore them off. Maybe, maybe things have changed in all the uh, couple of days since I last had them. But yeah, I guess all in all, I mean, I could understand snacking on the Hot Pocket. I am not going to snack on the Hot Pocket because, well, 
I don't see the point if you have to immediately follow it up with something else so your body actually knew it consumed something. I'm like, it almost seems like it's going to take more energy and nutrients out of my body to process the Hot Pocket than I'm actually going to get back from the Hot Pocket. I've had much worse first time food experiences and well, this is very pleasantly far from one of those times. Yes, Hot Pockets, you taste okay, but I think this is the first and final time our paths shall cross. Godspeed, Hot Pocket, and fare thee well. Yeah, I'm not going to do anything with dramatic acting or anything anytime soon. Yeah, that's that. It's a something out of something. Once I devise a ratings for videos and stuff like this, and just in case it's a thing, anybody that feels like commenting or throwing out a suggestion, because, well, if I haven't had a Hot Pocket, there's probably plenty of similar treats that I have foregone, so... If you want to hit me up with any suggestions, let me know in the comments, and I will see y'all in the next one. Okay, I just figured out the weird flavor. I mean, I still don't know what it is, but I finally know what it tasted like. Um, whatever it was, it kind of tasted a little like, well, dirt. I mean, and I like beets, but a Hot Pocket isn't a beet, so having something that isn't just naturally flavored like dirt is a little strange. So, yeah, uh, that was it. It was uh, dirt. Now, I'll see you in the next one.